Hello! So it looks like we're getting new expandable card options for your Xbox Series S and X. But honestly, Handsome Nation, I really don't see the reasons why, at this price, you would pick these up. But more about that later. So this article comes to us from TheVerge.com. Xbox Series S and X get new 512 gigabyte and two terabyte storage expansion card options. And we get more storage options, but no new manufacturers. Made by Seagate, there will be a similar 512 gigabyte card priced at 140 bucks. And a larger two terabyte card priced at $400. Golly, man. <laughs> These expandable storage cards slot into the rear of both the Xbox Series X and S to match the internal SSD speed and provide extra storage for games. Yes, this is the best way to expand your storage if you want that stupid fast internal NVMe SSD type of speed. But man, 140 bucks for 512 gigabytes and 400 bucks for two terabytes of storage? Man, you're paying at the wazoo for that convenience, <laughs> man. The first storage expansion card launched alongside the next generation of Xbox consoles, priced at about 220 bucks for one terabyte of space. So that means that the price of $298 for the Xbox Series S jumped to nearly $520 if you wanted to add more storage to bring it up to 1.5 terabytes overall. Now, as a lover of Xbox, price on this is just too high. <laughs> Man, it's just ridiculous. While the storage expansion card certainly offers an ease of use on the Xbox, there's still only a single manufacturer and the proprietary. Seagate's two terabyte model is priced lower than a top option like the Samsung 980 Pro SSD for the PS5, priced at 450 bucks. But Sony's more open approach to allow PS5 owners to purchase cheaper Gen 4 SSDs where you can pick up a two terabyte drive for less than 300 bucks. Microsoft has previously committed to opening up its storage expansion cards to more manufacturers and different size options. Yes, please open up the floodgates, Microsoft. The new 512 gigabyte Xbox storage expansion card will be available in mid-November from Walmart with the two terabyte option arriving in December. So they made the announcement today talking about these cards, but you can't get them to mid-November or mid-December depending on the size that you want. Whereas, this Seagate Game Drive for Xbox 2 terabyte external hard drive portable HDD is available right now for 70 bucks. I mean, look at this, this thing looks cool and it's still from Seagate. We got that green LED light at the front. It's looking nice and purdy and Xbox like. Or if you wanna go for broke, you know, we got four terabytes right here, 120 bucks. Come on, y'all. And this is available right now. No need to wait to November, no need to wait to December. Get it right now. Or the tried and true Seagate Game Drive for Xbox Game Pass Special Edition 4 terabyte white. The one I've been using for almost a year now. Get it right now for 110 bucks. Come on, 110 bucks and you get four terabytes. Now the big misconception about these external drives is the fact that they cannot play most next generation games are directly off those drives. However, you can store the next generation games, the, the ones that are optimized for the Series S and X, you can store them on these drives, these external drives. And then when you wanna play the games, you just transfer them to the internal NVMe SSD and you play them that way. It's that simple. Trust me, your pockets will thank you. So of course, everything we talked about is gonna be linked in the description down below. But if you wanna see why I love and use this game drive, then go right ahead and click the thumbnail on the screen. But until next time, Handsome Nation, Thank you and have a good one.